Now it's just stayed together with uh, quick stakes that uh, were made. One thing that I wanted to come over and show you guys was that what makes these little half shelters so great is this right here. So, you know, a normal size guy can uh, throw them down some type of uh, ground sheath or even just a bivy and uh, have some shelter. The second half here, which you see is thrown over the ridge line, can be strung out or staked out with uh, long branches to form a porch. So that's kind of one of the things that makes it kind of nice is because you can get a porch underneath here as well to give yourself uh, more shade, um, keep some rain off while you're doing a like a hiking stove or uh, Dakota fire pit type deal. Keeps um, it's great for shade. It's great for uh, keeping some wind off of you. Um, these were also coated in uh, the um, bug and insect repellent and uh, stored for about 20, 30 years. So uh, if you do have to get one of these, they may smell a little weird. Just take them out, use them, air them out. You'll be fine. Um, these are excellent, excellent options. They don't weigh much at all. And uh, it was good for the military, right? So, uh, just wanted to guys show you a different type of uh, shelter that you guys can also do. You can also set this up as well with a tarp. Because that's basically all these are, are button-up tarps. So, keep that in mind as well, is that you can set this up as a tarp shelter. See, everything here just buttons up. It's a very useful piece of kit. Don't be afraid to use military surplus. Just, uh... Keep your weight down and you'll be good.